And good evening and welcome to Pioneer Arena for tonight's volleyball action between the Pioneers of Tuscum University and the Battlers of Alderson Broadus. I'm Jim Miller, glad you could join us this evening for tonight's action. As the Pioneers come in with an 0-4 record looking for their first victory of the season, Alderson Broadus with a record of 2-3. Alderson Broadus has victories this season over Eastern Mennonite and Geneva, while Tusculum has lost to North Greenville twice. They've lost to Ball State, and they've lost to Erskine for their 0-4 record so far this season. Starting for the Pioneers tonight, it'll be Shafar Grant, 6'4", junior from Kingston, Jamaica. Also, Dane Loop, a 6-foot sophomore from Mandeville, Louisiana. Sean Kamshoff, the setter, a 6'3", senior from Las Vegas, Nevada. Jake White, a 6'4 junior from Greenbrier, Tennessee. Colby Landry getting the start, a 6'4 from Belrose, Louisiana. Declan Wingo, a 6'4 freshman from Chester, Virginia. And Taylor West is the libero this evening, 6'4 from Colorado Springs, Colorado. That's the lineup for Tusculum, coached by Brian Buckius in his first season. And Alderson Broadus will have the first serve this evening. Nathaniel Brownlee will have the service. He is a 6'5 freshman from Plainfield, Illinois. And we are underway as the attack coming from the right side there by Jake White is met by the defense of the Battlers. This will be played by West. Kampshoff with the set for Loop. And it is right back at him as a kill for Jalen Gray, sophomore out of Henderson, Nevada. So Alderson Broadus gets the first point of the match. And it's 1-0. Serve is in. Grant with the set this time. Playing in and out of the back row is Landry. And that'll be a kill for the Pioneers. Bobby Landry with the kill. Landry with 18 kills this season and 14 sets. He's played every set for the Pioneers. Sean Kamshoff will serve this one. And he will get an ace out of it. Will Kamshoff. Kamshoff, his seventh ace of the season. And Tusculum leads it 2-1. to one. Kamshoff. Ready for the serve. And is it in? It is. It's a point for Tusculum. Back-to-back -back aces for Sean Kampshaw. Tusculum with just 14 aces and 14 sets coming into play, but they get two aces here in this opening set on back-to-back -back serves by Kampshaw. And he'll bring that lefty serve again. This time it's Doug. This will be played by Cheenan and blocked by the Pioneers. Now the Pioneers get another point. They lead it 4-1 to one as they've picked up four straight points here. Three of them on the serve by Kampshaw. Kampshaw's serve this time near the bench area. It's set by Nielsen, and it'll be bumped over by Flores. Kampshaw goes cross court to loop, but he puts it wide, and that will be a point for Alderson Broadus. So a kill, two aces, and a block. Give the Pioneers a 4-1 to lead, but Alderson Broadus cuts it back to 4-2. to two. As serving now is Gannon Cheenan, the sophomore out of Pearl City, Hawaii. Set up for the attack, and the kill for Jake White. White leads the Pioneers in kills with 34 this season. That was his 35th of the year, hitting almost 200 for the Pioneers. This serve by Loop. Set up for the attack by Nielsen, and it will be a point for the Pioneers. As they get the block and lead it 6-2, to two, and it'll be a timeout for Alderson Broadus. We'll tell you a little bit about these teams. Again, Alderson Broadus 2-3 and three this season. While Tusculum coming in at 0-4. In their last match, Alderson Broadus went five sets against Geneva, 
on the 29th of this of January, and they won it by a score of three to two to improve their record to two and three. This is the first independent volleyball association match for both teams this season. And this will be the only meeting of the year between the squads. Austin Broad is coached by Chuck Shoemaker in his fourth season. Brian Bucky is to coach Tuscan in his first season. Looking for his first victory as pioneer head coach. As he finishes the discussion with his team. Out of the timeout will be Tusculum serve as Pioneers have two blocks in this opening set. White and Grant have teamed up on both of them. And this serve from Loop is long. It'll be a point for Alderson Broadus. So the Battlers pull within six to three. Serving for Alderson Broadus will be Andrew Nielsen, the 6'7 sophomore from Solvang, California. And it's a service error. It'll be a point for Tuscalum. First service error for Alderson Broadus in this match. And it'll be Shafar Grant to serve, 6'4 junior out of Kingston, Jamaica. Grant with two aces so far this season. This one will be played by Brownlee. On the attack is Gray. But it'll be a point for Tusculum. As the Pioneers get that point and now lead it 8-3. to three. Another block for the Pioneers as they've blocked three so far in the early going. They get that one through the block, but it also goes long. As that attack coming from Cheenan, it was too long. And the Pioneers advance their lead now to 9-3 to three here in this opening set. That's three out of five. Grant with the toss and the serve. Raises the net. It's played by Schweinefuss. He'll take it from the left side this time, and it's dug out by a loop. And a double hit there for the Pioneers. And it'll be a point for the Battlers. Michael Sch Schweinefuss and David Schweinefuss, both 6'4 freshmen out of Hamilton, Ohio. Jalen Gray on the serve here for Alderson Broadus, dug by a loop. Kampshoff cross to Landry. It's knocked down by the defense. Landry will try it again, and this time he puts it down for the kill. Colby Landry with a couple kills here in this opening set as he put that one away nicely. Jake White will serve for Tusculum. White, the 6'4 junior out of Greenbrier, Tennessee. It'll be Schweinefuss, and it's dug up by West. Battle at the net. It'll be kept alive by the battler. Schweinefuss goes again. This one goes over the net, saved by the Pioneers, played across to Landry, and it's dug up by Flores. And going along with the attack that time is Cheenan, and it's a point for Tusculum. The Pioneers now lead 11 to 4. Alderson brought us struggling in the hitting game so far. It's looking for their first kill of the match. White with the service. Bumped across by Schweinefuss. Kampschoff sets it up for Wingo. Can the Pioneers save it? They cannot. And it'll be a point for Alderson Broadus. The Battlers cut it to 11 to 5. Schweinefuss to serve. Landry for Kampschoff. White gets the kill for the Pioneers. Jake White puts that one down. His second kill. He found it off of the set. And a point for the Pioneers, making it 12 to 5. Landry to serve for Tusculum. Flores digs it. Brownlee with the set. Ethan Sturm with the attack. It is not to be again as Tusculum again denying Alderson Broadus. 
13 to five Pioneers. Landry serve. This time the attack from Sturm is dug up by the Pioneers. And Loop with the kill. Dane Loop with his first kill of the uh, evening. As he puts that one down. 14 to five Tuscal. The Pioneers off to a fast start here in this opening set. Landry's serve is just a little bit deep. And it's the third service error for the Pioneers. Alderson brought us half of their six points have come on the service error. Serving for Alderson Broadus is Stern. Kampshoff, right back at him. White will set it up this time for Loop, and he'll deliver the kill right into the stats table. Point for the Pioneers, they lead it 15 to six. That's Dom Donnelly goes flying out of the way of that volleyball. 15 to six, the serve by Wingo. This will be Cheenan, and it will be wide. And a point for the Pioneers. 16 to six, Tusker. And Alderson brought us once a timeout. 16 to six, Tusculum here in the first set. We'll take a timeout as well. We'll be back for more action after this on the Pioneer Sports Network. Back here at Pioneer Arena, Tusculum leading 16 to six over Alderson Broadus in his first set. Pioneers hitting 308 in the opening set, six kills and 13 attacks, while Alderson Broadus has seven hitting errors. They're hitting negative 429. Brownlee with the set, the attack, and that time they'll get the kill, Will Gannon Cheenan. The second kill of the set for Alderson Broadus. They now trail at 16 to seven. Nathaniel Brownlee will serve. And it is in, and it is an ace for Brownlee. His sixth ace of the season. Alderson Broadus averages about one and a half aces per set. It's now a 16 to eight score. This one is dug up by Landry for Camshaw. Plays it back to Grant and he hits it into the net for an error. Just the third hitting error of this match for the Pioneers. And now lead it 16 to nine. Bradley to Loop. Camshaw back to Loop. Off the block and into the rafters. And it's a blocking error. It'll be a point for the Pioneers. As Gray was in the net. I don't think I've ever seen a volleyball get up that high. That was, that was way up there. Kind of looked like Plinko working its way down through the rafters. 17 to nine, Tusker. Cam Shoffel, sir. He has two aces so far. Make it three for Sean Cam as Kampshoff buries this one past the, the diving Flores. And it'll be an ace for the Pioneers. It's 18 to nine Tusculum. Tusculum with just two set wins this season, 25-19 and 25-23. And another ace for Kampshoff. Make it four aces for Sean Kampshoff. But he is from Vegas, so that is appropriate. 19 to nine Tusculum.
Kamshoff looking for the full house, and he gets it. Five aces for Sean Kamshoff, three in a row, and Tusculum leads it 20 to nine as he just hammered that one down. Kamshop unstoppable in his opening set. How about another one? Nope, dug up that time. But blocked at the net. And it's going to be a point for Alderson Broadus as Grant got up there, but they get the point, does Alderson Broadus. So Sean Kamshop, five aces in his first set. Tuscan was seven or with five aces. Also, Kamshoff has five assists as well. Grant plays it across. White's going to have to do something with it, and he can't as it goes around the antenna. It's a point for Alderson Broadus. 20 to 11 the score here in the opening set. Cheenan on the serve. West for Kamshoff. Loop puts it down. Dane Loop with the kill. His fourth kill of this match. Off the nice set there by Kamshoff, puts it down for the kill. 21 to 11, Tusculum with the lead. And Dane Loop will serve, the sophomore out of Mandeville, Louisiana. Flores. Now it's Schweinefus. Kamshoff digs it. West will set it up for White. Too long. Point for Alderson Broadus, 21 to 12. Tesselman prior to that point was hitting 235 as a team in this set. Alderson brought is still at negative 250. Serving for the Battlers is Andrew Nielsen. And this one is into the net for a point on the service error. Second service error for Alderson brought us. 22 to 12, Tuscal. That'll be Shafar Grant to serve. Grant. With the toss in the service, Flores, Brownlee, Gray blocked at the net by the Pioneers as White got up there again. Jake White with four blocks in this first, or no, it's going to be an error. He did put it down. I thought he blocked it, but he didn't. It's a point for Alderson Broadus, 22 to 13. Kampshoff, and that one tapped there by Wingo is wide, another point for the Battlers. 22 to 14 as Tusculum trying to put away this first set. Gray's service handled by Loop. Kampshoff setting up Landry and off a hand and out of play, it'll be a point for the Pioneers. It'll be Jake White to serve for the Pioneers at 23 to 14. White's service is played by Cheenan. Schweinefuss is wide, and it's a point for the Pioneers, and now it is set point. 24 to 14 as Tusculum looks to take a 1 0 lead. It would be their first lead of the season. Both, both of their set wins came when they were trailing two sets to zero. So for the Pioneers, it would be a good start in this match. White with the service into the net. We'll have to do it on the side out as it's 24 to 15. Schweinefus to serve for the Battlers. As Tusculum looks to close out this opening set. And it's going to be an ace as West can't handle that serve. 24-16. This serve goes to Loop. West will play it back over. And it'll be Landry. Set up by Gray. And it'll be bumped over by Flores. Loop, can't get it past the defense there. Gray, wide, point Pioneers, they win the first set. 25-16, Tusculum takes the first set. 
And the Pioneers lead it one set to zero. So Tusculum gets off to a good start here, leading, winning the first set 25 to 16. We'll be back with set number two after this on the Pioneer Sports Network. Welcome back to Pioneer Arena, where Tuscaloosa wins the first set 25 to 16 over Alderson Broadus. Taking a look at those first set statistics, Dane Loop with four kills for the Pioneers, Colby Landry with three, Jake White with two. Tuscaloosa hit 136 in the first set, nine kills, six errors, 22 attacks. Alderson Broadus, they hit negative 250, four kills, nine errors on 20 attacks. Sean Kamshoff had seven assists and five aces in the first set for the Pioneers. Tuscaloosa out digging Alderson brought us seven to four. The Pioneers with three blocks in that set. Jake White had an assist on all three of them. Tuscaloosa winning two out of three side outs in that first set. So we'll go here with set number two. The Pioneers running the same lineup as they did in the first set. Alderson brought us. We'll have Brownlee out there along with Chenin. David Schweinefuss making his first appearance of the set along with Michael Schweinefuss. Jalen Gray, Ethan Sturm. And Raymond Green. The libero in the second set. I may just call them David and Michael out of convenience for the uh, battlers. Now we're getting the lineups set up here for set number two. Tesla might have to serve to start the second set. Pioneers at 136 in that first set as a team. Their season hitting percentage, 090. Alderson brought us his season hitting percentage is 113. And it'll be Sean Kamshoff. He of the five aces in the first set. Gina with the dig right to Grant, but with the dig there was Brownlee, bumped over by the Battlers, and now bumped back over by Loop. Gray in for the point for Alderson Broadus. Jalen Gray, second kill of the match. And just like the first set, Alderson Broadus takes a 1 nothing lead. Gannon Chinen will serve, the sophomore out of Pearl City, Hawaii. Loop. Kampshoff setting up to Grant, but it was over him, and it's going to be a point for Alderson Broadus as Luke can't get it over the net. 2 nothing, Battlers here in set number two.
Kamshoff sets it up for White. Dug nicely there by Green. Schweinefuss dug by West. Kamshoff sets up Landry, and it's in. Colby Landry with another kill, his fourth. And the Pioneers get their first point, and they trail it two to one. Dan Loop will serve for Tusculum. Gets that one in. And Grant puts it down. Schweinefuss had the dig, but it went to Grant. As the dig goes right over the net, and Shafar Grant says thank you very much. Gets his first kill of the match, and it's tied up at two. Loop serves that one in the net. It'll be an error. Fourth service error for Tuscal. And the Battlers back up three to two. David Schweinefuss. Serve goes to Loop. Kamshoff goes cross court to Landry, and he gets it down. Colby Landry with his fifth kill in seven attacks. As Gray went up for the block, couldn't get it, and they couldn't save it. So Shafar Grant with the kill now serves at three all. Grant serve goes to Green. From the back row, it's Cheenan, and it is too long, and it is a point for the Pioneers. Tuscum goes up four to three. Pioneers have their first lead of the second set. Bradley sets up Gray. White put the pancake and keeps it alive. This time off the block, it's going to be a kill for Schweinefuss. Michael Schweinefuss with the kill, his first. Gray serves now at four all here in set number two. Loop over the net, and an easy one there for Nathaniel Brownlee, the 6'5 freshman out of Plainfield, Illinois. His 10th kill of the season. And the Battlers back up 5-4. Landry for Kampshoff. White gets it down. Jake White, his third kill of this match, and the Pioneers back at, even at 5-all. White ready to serve. Serve goes to Green. Over the net, and what do we have? In the net, that's a point for the Pioneers. So an error there for the Battlers, and Tunstall needs it six to five. Chuck Williams going out to retrieve a loose ball. Serving is White. Cheenan with the dig, set up by Brownlee. Schweinefuss gets a kill. Puts it down in front of Loop. For Michael Schweinefuss' his second kill of the match. We're locked at six. This one is deep, and it's a point for Tusculum. Third service error for Alderson Broadus. Brownlee for Gray. Kamshoff salvages it. And the Ballers will go again. Cheenan with a changeup. Pancake by White. Set up for Loop. Dug over. Kamshaw puts it down. Great work there by White to keep it alive, and great work by Kamshaw to hammer it down for the kill. And Tusculum leads it 8-6. to six.
Landry on the serve. Green for Brownlee. Cheenan looking for the block there was Wingo, but he could not keep it in. And the point goes to the Bowers. 8-7, Tusculum here in set number two. Ethan Sturm, the 6'5 freshman out of Illinois. That one is off the antenna. That will be a point for the Pioneers. Tusculum now leads it 9-7. to seven. Declan Wingo will serve for the Pioneers, a 6'4 freshman out of Chester, Virginia. In the net, point for the Battlers. Fifth service error for Tuscal. And it's nine, eight Pioneers here in set number two. Nathaniel Brownlee will serve it, the setter for Alderson Broadus. Loop for Campshaw. White. Brownlee gets a hand on it. Don't have to free ball it over. West, Campshaw to Grant for the kill. Shafar Grant, second kill of the match. As it was set up perfectly, great set there by Kamshoff and Grant goes up to put it down. 10-8 Tuscal. Here's Kamshoff. Green, Brownlee sets up Gray. The change up, Kamshoff dives across to get it and Luke plays it over. And it hits the floor, and it's a point for the Pioneers. Kamshoff lays out, and Loop winds up finishing it, and Tusculum leads it 11 to 8. Kamshoff now with 12 assists. Set up by Brownlee to Gray. Again, Cheenan off the tape, point Pioneers. 12-8 Tusculum. Now we have a whistle and the support on the net came loose. And Jake White fixes that up. Now we're ready to resume action. Kamshoff with the service. Schweinefuss over the net, White back over to Brownlee. Green, back row, Schweinefuss. Dug up by West. Kamshoff, loop. Dug by Cheen and off the scoreboard, that's in play. Schweinefuss again, dug by Landry. Kamshoff to Grant. Deep point, Alderson brought us. Good rally there, but Tusculum couldn't put it down. And the Ballers battle back to within 12-9. Gannon Cheenan will serve it for the Battlers at 9-12. And West gets out of the way, but not the play there as the ball knuckles its way in. The point for the Battlers on the ace. My perspective is right on that baseline in the crow's nest, so to speak. So I see the movement on those serves. That's tricky. Grant. Schweinefuss to West. Kampschoff back over to Loop. And he hit that one off the side of his hand. And it's a point for Alderson Broadus. And now they're back to within 12 11. On back three straight points now for the Bowers. The last two on the serve of Cheenan. West for Kampschoff. And a miscommunication there. White couldn't do anything with it as he had thought Grant was going to get it. And that's a point for Alderson Broadus. We're tied at 12. Cheenan will serve. West, camps off to Grant. Off of Schweinefuss, still in play. Brownlee will tap it over. Camps off right back, and Cheenan digs it. Brownlee for Gray. And Grant can't get the block. And it's a point for Alderson Broadus. And the Battlers have run off four in a row and now lead at 13 to 12. Coach Brian Buckius wants a timeout for Tusculum. 13 12, Alderson Broadus here in set number two. More volleyball action coming up on the Pioneer Sports Network.
Back here at Pioneer Arena where Tusculum trails 13 to 12 in the second set. Tusculum baseball team is playing its season opener as we speak down at Barry University in Florida. And the Pioneers scored five runs in the top of the first inning. A good start to the season. Here it's one nothing sets for Tusculum. 13-12 Alderson brought us here in the second set as Shafar Grant with the attack. Brownlee digs it out. Cheenan and Grant puts it down with the block. Solo block there for for Grant, his third block of the match. Now we're tied at 13. Loop with the service, Schweinefuss. And this is David Schweinefuss getting the kill. His first kill of the match. Now we're locked up, but Alderson brought us back on top, 14 to 13. David Schweinefuss to serve. West, Camps off to Grant, that one's wide. And it's a point for the Battlers, 15 to 13. Alderson Broad is hitting much better in the second set, 150. Tuscombe hitting 136. Schweinefuss, that, that had a chance to go wide. Loop played it. It doesn't matter, it's a point for the Battlers. And they now lead it 16 to 13. Tuscombe had the lead at 12 to nine. Loop plays this one, Kampshoff for White, the tip. Loose on the Alderson Broadus side, Kampshoff. White, kill. Jake White with another kill, his fourth of this match. And Tuscombe back within 16 to 14. Nice set there by Kampshoff. White put that one down. Shafar Grant will serve at 14-16. Green, Brownlee, one handed over by Schweinefuss. Cross court, Landry, and the block is successful for Ethan Sturm. Sturm goes up, gets the block. Second block of the match for the Battlers. And they now lead it 17 to 14. Jalen Gray to serve for Alderson Broadus. Off of West, loop. Wingo, free to Gray. And off the side, that's still in play. Cross court and they're going wide with it was white. Pioneers caught a break. As you can see that overhang where those banners are located. That's in play, and it hit the this the camera side of that. So you can, if you're looking at it, see those banners up top. That's what hit hit that wall up there. That's in play, and it bounced back. And Tuscum had a chance to get the point, but couldn't do it. 18 to 14. As Kampshoff sets it up for White, off a hand, Brownlee, Gray, wide point Pioneers. And Tuscum works it back to 18 to 15 here in set number two. Jake White will serve it up for the Pioneers. White's service. And going in front of Green was Cheenan. As Green had that lined up and Cheenan stepped in front of him and put it under the net. So an ace for the Pioneers. Ace for Jake White, who only had one ace all season coming into play today. His serve is played by Cheenan. It'll be Schweinefuss, dug by West over the net. Brownlee, it's a free ball. Wingo puts it down. Declan Wingo with the kill. Play got a little ragged there, and Wingo puts down the kill. His first kill of the evening. It's 18-17, Ballers. White. Set up for Schweinefuss. Play continues. Schweinefuss again. Kamshoff, cross court. Winner. 
as it's down. And Kampshoff gets the point. There was a little confusion as to whether it was or not. We'll see here on this replay. Oh, yeah. Point for Kampshoff, and we are locked at 18. As Tuscum has fought its way back with three points in a row. And White into the net. 19-18, Battlers. Michael Schweinefuss to serve for Alderson Broadus. West for Kampshoff. Goes across to Landry off the antenna. Going to be a point for Alderson Broadus. They've gotten two in a row and now lead it 20-18. So it'll be West for Kampshoff. Wingo. And it is a point for the Pioneers as it's off a hand. It is off a hand. Yep, right there. Off the hand of the blocker, Cheenan, who is at the net. No argument from the Battlers. It's 20 to 19, Alderson brought us. Landry to serve. Green for Brownlee. White digs it. Going for the block there was Kampshoff, but it was out of bounds off the attack of Cheenan. And it's a point for Alderson Broadus. They lead it 21 to 19. Ethan Sturm to serve for Alderson Broadus. Kampshoff sets it up for Wingo. Kampshoff sets it up this time for Loop. It was cross court played by Cheenan. Brownlee trying to attack himself. Pioneers are ready for it. White down the line. Gets the kill. As White took it right down the line here after the Pioneers were able to save it right there. And a kill for Jake White, his fifth of the match. And it's 21-20. Now we're going to have a discussion here. The line judge, the, uh, the, yes, they're going to say it's wide. The line judge was diving for cover as that attack was coming right at her. And the down official, in consultation with our chair referee, determines that it's a point for Alderson Broadus, and they now lead it 22 to 19, and it's a timeout taken by Tuscaloosa. So the Pioneers down 22-19 here in this second set. We'll try and go on a little bit of a run here at the end. If they're going to take a 2-0 lead. Alderson brought us in their last match, went five sets with Geneva. They alternated set wins. Fowler's winning 1-3 and 5. Geneva winning sets 2 and 4. Common opponent with these teams is North Greenville. Tuscan lost to North Greenville 3-1 at home and 3-0 and on the road. Alderson brought us lost to North Greenville 3-1 at home. Pioneers will be right back at it here tomorrow against Erskine. First serve will be 2 o'clock between the Pioneers and the Flying Fleet. Tuscan played Erskine on Monday night and lost that one on the road by a score of 3-1 to one down in Dewest, South Carolina. 2 o'clock will be coverage tomorrow here on the Pioneer Sports Network. Tuscan with five straight home matches. Next weekend they'll be home with Limestone, 7 o'clock Friday night. And then Queens for a 2 o'clock match on Saturday, February the 12th. Then another Friday night match coming up on February the 18th against Fort Valley State. And after that, Tuscan with just a handful of home matches left the rest of the season. 22-19, Alderson brought us on the serve. Kampshoff for White, cross court, still in play. Brownlee, and unable to make the play was Cheenan, and it's a point for the Pioneers. 22-20, Tuscan back within two. Declan Wingo will serve for the Pioneers. Schweinefuss for Brownlee. Sheenan off of loop and into the seats, into the second row. Point for Alderson Broadus. They lead it 23 20. Big point here in this match. Nathaniel Brownlee to serve for the Battlers. Tuscum has burned both its timeouts here in the second set. Brownlee's service is played by Landry for Kampshoff. Grant 
Dug up by Green. Sheenan, it's a free ball, and it is a point for the Battlers. And Alderson brought us now with set point. They lead it 24 to 20. Brownlee will serve set point. It is knuckling out. Point for the Pioneers. They trail 24 21. Well, the guy you want serving is the guy serving, Sean Kampshoff. Sean Kampshoff had five aces in the first set. He doesn't have any yet in the second set, but this would be a good time for a run. Grazes the net. Schweinefuss for Chinen, dug up by Landry. Kamshoff sets up White. Brownlee, Chinen, Grant got a hand on it. Bumped over by Schweinefuss. Oh, oh, great dig there by Landry. And putting it down is Jake White for the Pioneers. The Tuscan gets the first of the points they needed. As White hammers it down, it's 24-22. Pioneers need two more points to try and force, to try and keep the Battlers from winning the match. Set. Cheenan, it's a free ball. West for Kampschoff, cross to loop, and it's blocked down by David Schweinefuss. And it's a point for Alderson Broadus, and they win the second set 25-22. So we'll play four at least. As we are tied up at one set apiece, Alderson brought us winning the second set 25-22. We'll be back with more volleyball action after this on the Pioneer Sports Network. Ready for set number three between Tusculum and Alderson Broadus. We are tied at one set apiece. Jim Miller with you this evening here on the Pioneer Sports Network. Glad you could join us. Our producer this evening is Aaron Fudge. As Tusculum winning the first set by a score of 25-16, but Alderson Broadus coming back to win the second set 25-22. Gannon Sheenan, the leader in kills for Alderson Broadus with five, but he has eight attack errors. Alderson Broadus still hitting negative 0-18. 14 kills and 15 errors through two sets. Tusculum hitting 079 for the match, 21 kills and 16 attack errors. They had 10 attack errors in the second set. Dane Loop, Jake White, and Colby Landry with five kills apiece to lead the Pioneers. Nathaniel Brownlee with 12 assists for the Battlers, while Sean Kamshoff has 15 assists. Dig leaders, Taylor West with eight for the Pioneers. And for the Battlers, it's Gannon Sheenan and Nathaniel Brownlee with four digs apiece. 
lot of digs in this match. 23 for Tusculum, 21 for Alderson Broadus. Alderson Broadus will serve to start the third set. It'll be Nathaniel Brownlee to serve. As we're ready to go with set number three. Tied at one. The serve is in for Landry. Cam Shaw for a loop. Cross court gets the winner. Off of Cheenan. Loop's sixth kill of the match as Loop throws cross court right off of Cheenan for the point. Sean Camshoff will serve first for the Pioneers here in set number three. In the net, it's a point for Alderson Broadus. Tuscombe's seventh service error of the match. Just five service errors for Alderson Broadus. Cheenan will serve for the Battlers. Landry for Kamshoff. Grant off of Brownlee at the net. It'll be Kamshoff setting it up for White. And he gets it down in front of the pancake attempt of Cheenan. As White goes down with it for the kill, his sixth kill of the match. And Tuscan leads it 2-1. to one. Dane Loop to serve. Brownlee, back row Cheenan, too strong. Point Pioneers. Tuscan leads it three to one. Three to one. Tuscan with the lead. Served by a loop. Brownlee setting it up for David Schweinefuss. Great save there by Kampshoff. Grant will play it over. Green will bump it for Gray. Continuing, it's Cheenan. Into the net, and a point for the Pioneers. Tuscan leads it four to one. Four one Tuscan here in set number two or set three. Loop wide into the bench. That's a point for Alderson Broadus. David Schweinefus to serve for Alderson Broadus. Landry for Kampshoff. White gets it to Michael Schweinefuss's attack there is met by Loop. Into the net goes Landry. It's a point for Alderson Broadus. And the Battler's back within four of the three. Kampshoff sets it up for White. And a kill for White in front of Brown. White hammers it down for the kill, his seventh of the match. That'll be Shafar Grant to serve at 5-3. Too deep, point for Alderson Broadus. Ninth error of the match for Pioneers on the serve. Jalen Gray serving for Alderson Broadus. Landry for Kampshoff, White again, off the hands of Schweinefuss. Cheenan for Brownlee, back to Schweinefuss, blocked at the net by White and Wingo. Brownlee again sets it up. This time, it is Sturm with the kill. Ethan Sturm gets a kill at the net, his second kill. And we are tied at five. Gray with the serve here for the Battlers. Loop digs it for Kampshoff. Landry puts it down for the kill. Colby Landry with some authority on that one. Six kills now for Landry. Tusculum leads it again, six to five. Jake White to serve for Tusculum. Keenan, 
now Bradley back to Cheatham. Kamshoff puts it back. Schweinefuss, battle at the net, and I think, yes, Wingo got his hands on the net, pulled it down a little bit. It's a point for Alderson Broadus. We're tied at six. You saw the net just pull down just a little bit. Wingo knew it. And we're six all. Schweinefuss to serve. Landry for Camshaw. Wingo with the kill. After that last point, Wingo had a little bit extra on that one, and the block was unsuccessful, and it's seven to six. Colby Landry to serve for Tusculum. Cheenan for Brownlee goes back to Cheenan. Down the line, deep and wide. Point for the Pioneers. They lead it eight to six. Landry's service. Brownlee for Sturm, and West can't dig it out. Another kill for Ethan Sturm. And it's eight to seven, Tusculum. Sturm with the toss and the serve. Landry, Kamshaw, cross, and putting it down is Dane Loop. Loop with the kill, his seventh. And it's nine seven, Tusculum. Declan Wingo to serve for the Pioneers. Cheenan will have to set this one up. It's a free ball and into the net, and it's a point for the Pioneers. As Brownlee and David Schweinefuss went for it together, and the play never really had a chance of getting off the ground. 10 7 Tusculum. Sheenan blocked at the net by Kamshoff and Grant. Grant's fourth block in the match. Kamshoff's first. As just like that, off of the attack, boom, down it goes. Tuscum now with five blocks in the match. And Alderson Broadus wants to discuss things, trailing 11-7 to seven here in set number three. Tuscan baseball is still leading Barry five to nothing in the second inning. Tuscan got five runs in the top of the first. Gunnar Becker, the Tuscan ace, is on the mound, and he has been solid so far. Tomorrow, action around Pioneer Sports World. Track and field is finishing up. They've got a couple runners at the Buccaneer Invitational at ETSU. Women's Bowling at the Rail Splitter Classic at the LMU. Softball opens the season tomorrow at USC Aiken, 1 o'clock first pitch. Pioneer basketball teams will be at Newberry tomorrow, doubleheader, the women at 2 o'clock, the men at 4 o'clock. And baseball will play at Palm Beach Atlantic tomorrow at 2 o'clock. And, of course, we'll have volleyball here tomorrow at 2 o'clock against Erskine. Out of the timeout, it'll be Tusculum's serve as Wingo will have the service. Eleven seven Tusculum here in set number three. Green, Brownlee, David Schweinefuss blocked at the net. Free ball. Brownlee plays it over. Wingo for Campshaw. Tipped over by Loop. Back row, Schweinefuss. Again at the net. Kamshoff dunks it and gets the kill. A lot of action on that point, but Tusculum winds up getting it. They lead it 12 to 7. It wasn't pretty. The Pioneers will take it. 12 7, Tusculum. Free ball, Cheenan plays it over. Kamshoff for loop, off a hand, still alive, bumped over by Grant. 
Brownlee setting it up for David Schweinefuss, and he gets the kill. His second kill of the match, and it's 12-8. Brownlee will serve. Brownlee's service goes to West. Kampshoff, Loop, puts it down. Dane Loop, eight kills now for Loop. Off the nice set, gets the kill in front of Brownlee. 13 8 Tunskalum, and Kampshoff will serve. Kampshoff, Schweinefuss dug it, and now he'll play it over. West, nice pass to Kampshoff, Grant gets rejected at the net. They'll try it again. This time it's dunked over by Gray for the kill. As Loop tried to go for it, and Gray met him at the net and dunked it down for the kill. 13 to 9. Tuscan leading by four. Gannon Cheenan will serve it for the Battlers. Cheenan's serve goes to Loop. Kampshoff, cross court to White. Sheenan digs it up. Michael Schweinefuss, played by Kampshoff. West with the set this time for Loop. Cross court dug by Brownlee. Green with the bump. Schweinefuss over for White. Kampshoff, back row, Landry gets the kill. Colby Landry's seventh kill of the match. And Tusculum leads it 14 to nine. Dane Loop will serve it for the Pioneers. Loop with eight kills, leads all players this evening. Tuscum hitting 129 in the match. And that serve is deep from Loop. Service error for Tuscum, their 10th service error of the match. Alderson brought us still with five service errors. Battler still hitting negative, 17 kills, 20 errors. David Schweinefuss with the serve. Loop, Kampshoff, Grant. And are they saying it's tipped? Yes, tipped to the point for the Pioneers. We'll have a discussion from the, the, uh, the uh, line judge on this side. As you can see she's discussing it with the chair official. She saw a tip and they get the point, does Tuscal. That's 15 to 10. Fifteen to ten Tusculum as we're having a had a little bit of a discussion. And we're ready to go. Grant serving. Cheenan, Brownlee, Michael Schweinefuss, wide point for Tusculum. Sixteen to ten Pioneers. Is Tusculum building on its lead here in this third set? Grant with the toss and the serve down the line. That one is wide. It's a point for Alderson Broadus. 16 to 11. Gray with the serve. Loop gets a hand on it. Kampshoff to Wingo. Dug by Cheenan. Brownlee. Schweinefuss. Dug by West. Kampshoff, Landry, I think it went off the antenna, and it did. It's a point for Alderson Broadus. 16 to 12, the Battlers battle back to within four. Gray to serve. Down the line, and an ace as Landry can't get there. For Gray, it's his first ace of the match his third of the season, and it's 16-13. Five aces now for Alderson Broadus. This one's into the net, and it'll be a service error, and it'll be a point for the Pioneers. 17-13, Tusculum. Now, 
Jake White to serve it for the Pioneers. White, seven kills this evening. Also has five digs, three blocks. An assist and an ace. The serve is in. Brownlee, Schweinefuss puts it down in front of West. Michael Schweinefuss with his third kill of the evening at 17-14, and now he will serve. Schweinerfuss with the serve. Kampshoff, White, still alive. Brownlee will play it over. Kampshoff drills it and gets the kill. Has a perfect set from Brownlee to Kampshoff. Kampshoff hammers it down for the kill. His fourth of the match is 18 14 Tuscal. Colby Landry to serve for the Pioneers. Eighteen to fourteen, Tuscola. Landry serve is dug by Green from the back row. Schweinefuss goes wide, point Tuscola. Nineteen to fourteen, Pioneers. And the second timeout asked for and granted to Alderson Broadus. Tuscola nineteen, Alderson Broadus fourteen. Back with more volleyball action after this on the Pioneer Sports Network. Back here, Pioneer Arena, Tuscal meeting Alderson brought us 19 to 14 here in set number three. Tuscal winning the first set, losing the second set, and now leading here in this third set. Alderson brought us has burned both of its timeouts here in the third set. Bobby Landry back on the serve for the Pioneers. That one is deep, it's a point for Alderson brought us. 19 to 15. Ethan Sturm to serve for Alderson Broadus. That serve is an ace as it got past Landry for the kill, or for the ace. Sturm's first ace of the evening. It's fourth of the year. Nineteen sixteen. This one goes into the net for a point for the Pioneers. 20 to 16, Tuscal. That'll be Declan Wingo to serve. Wingo's service is played by Schweinerfuss. Gray tipped it right on over and tipped it right on out. It's a point for the Pioneers, 21-16. Pioneers score on their serve there. Brownlee goes down for Cheenan. Loop to White, he'll play it over. Brownlee again. Cheenan wide point Pioneers. 22-16 Tuscal. Cheenan now with five kills and 13 errors in the match. Tuscum has scored three straight. Into the net goes Wingo, and that's a point for Alderson Broadus. The 
Nathaniel Brownlee to serve for Alderson Broadus at 22-17. His serve is in for Loop. Camshaw for White. Dug by Green. Schweinefuss will set it up. Free ball played over by Brownlee. Campshoff, cross court, Loop down the line. It's in. It's a point for the Pioneers as Dane Loop gets his ninth kill. Right in that corner. 23-17 Tuscola. And Sean Camshoff will serve. Campshoff. Brownlee. David Schweinefuss cross court for the kill. His third kill. And it's 23-18. Cannon Cheenan will serve at 18-23. New libero for the Pioneers is Ross Miller. And the Pioneers get the point there. As he set it up perfectly for Shafar Grant, did Kampshoff. 24-18 Tusculum, it's set point. Dane Loop will serve. Schweinefuss for Loop. Kampshoff for Grant. Saved by Cheenan, free ball. Played over by Green. Kampshoff to White, gets the kill, and the Pioneers take the third set, 25 to 18. And the Pioneers lead the set, series, or lead the match now, two sets to one, as White gets his eighth kill of the match, and Tuscan leads it two sets to one. We'll have the fourth set coming up for you here in a few moments. Tuscan leads Alderson brought us two to one on the Pioneer Sports Network. Fourth set between Tusculum and Alderson brought us about to get going here as the Pioneers lead it two sets to one. Glad you could join us this evening on the Pioneer Sports Network. I'm Jim Miller with the coverage this evening from Pioneer Arena. Tusculum winning the first set 25-16, losing set two 25-22, and then winning the third set 
Leading the way for Tusculum through three sets, Dane Loop, nine kills, Jake White, eight, Colby Landry with seven, Sean Kamshoff and Shafar Grant, four kills each, Declan Wingo with three. Sean Kamshoff with 27 assists, also with five aces. Dig leaders Taylor West with 10, Shafar Grant leading with four blocks for the Pioneers. For Alderson Broadus, they are led by Gannon Cheenan with five kills. Assist leaders Nathaniel Brownlee with 16, and Brownlee also leading the team with eight digs along with Cheenan. Three blocks for Jalen Gray. Tuscombe hitting 156 as a team, 35 kills, 20 errors. Alderson Broadus hitting negative 061, 19 kills, 24 errors. Both teams with six aces, Tuscombe with 13 service errors to seven for the Ballers. Alderson Broadus 33 to 31 lead in digs through three sets. Kampshoff starts the fourth set on the serve. He'll dig that attack by Schweinefus. Taylor West is out of the lineup right now for the Pioneers. The libero is Ross Miller. This one is set up for Dane Loop, and he gets the kill off the hands of the defense. And the Pioneers get the first point of this third, fourth set. Ross Miller, the freshman, 5'9", out of Metairie, Louisiana. Kampshoff's serve. Green. Gray, and the attack there is wide. Another point for the Pioneers. Tesselum leads it 2-0 here in the fourth set, looking for their first win of the season. Kampshoff will serve it. Puts it in. Grant. Brownlee setting it up for David Schweinefuss. Tries to go cross court. It's still alive. Sheenan dug up by Miller. Whistle. And into the net was, I believe, Grant. And it'll be a point for Alderson Broadus. And it's 2-1. to one. And then Cheenan serving it for the Battlers. Miller. Grant with authority. Shafar Grant's fifth kill of the evening. As Miller dug the serve and Grant finished it off. 3-1 Tuscola. Loop will serve. Off the net and down for the kill. Lucky roll for Loop. That's not luck, it's skill. Right off the tape for Dane Loop. His first ace of the evening. As fourth of the season. 4-1 Tusculum. Loop serve is too long. It's a point for Alderson Broadus. 14 service errors now for the Pioneers. Tusculum baseball now leading 10 to nothing in the third inning on Barry. Gray's serve, dug by Miller. Kampshoff, White tips it over and gets it in. Right in front of Cheenan. He just tipped that one down. And gets the point, it's 5-2 Tusculum. Shafar Grant on the serve, too deep, point. Alderson brought us. David Schweinefus will serve it for the Battlers at 5 3, Tusselin with the lead. The serve is in. Landry for Kampshoff. Wingo puts it down. Declan Wingo's fourth kill of the match. And Tusselin leads it 6 to 3. Set up perfectly there for Wingo, who put it down in front of Cheenan for the kill. 6-3, Tuscal. White serve is in the net, point for Alderson Broadus. Michael Schweinefuss will serve. Landry for Kampshoff. Wingo again. Gets it again. Pinballs it through the defense and it gets the point for the Pioneers. Nicely done there by Wingo. As he has five kills now. Wingo. 
Landry's serve. Sturm goes to the net. The Pioneers say no. As Loop was there along with Wingo. And it's a point for the Pioneers. They lead it 8 to 4. Serve from Landry off the tape and another ace for the Pioneers. Eight aces now for Tuscal, and they lead it nine to four. Landry serve. Cheenan off of Miller for the eight, or for the kill. Sturm will have the service. Landry for Kampschoff, cross to Loop. Drops it in for the point. As Brownlee was at the net, and there was nobody behind him. He says, what, where were you guys? 10-5 Tuscola. Wingo will serve. Grazes the net, Brownlee. Sheenan blocked by Kampschoff and Grant for the point for the Pioneers. As they go up together, put it down. Wow, there's a lot of Kampschoff there. 11-5 Tusculum timeout. All this and brought is more volleyball action coming up on the Pioneer Sports Network. Back here at Pioneer Arena where Tuscan leads 11 to five in the fourth set. <laughs> 11 to five, Tuscan here in this fourth set. Serving for the Pioneers is Wingo. Off of Schweinefuss and it's an ace for Declan Wingo. His first ace of the evening and his first of the season. Tusculum now with nine aces this evening. They lead it 12 to 5. Greenlee across. Sheenan off a hand. Set up by Landry to loop. They looked for a double hit, didn't get it. Brownlee, Sheenan blocked by Kampschoff. Sean Kampschoff with another block, his third of the match. He got it down. 13-5 Tusculum. Into the net goes Wingo. 13-6. Brownlee to serve. As Alderson Broadus needs to find some points in a hurry. Miller, Kampschoff, Grant, kill, point Pioneers. Bing, bang, boom. That's how you draw it up. Just that simple. Shafar Grant now with six kills this evening. 14-6 Tuscal. Sean Kampschoff will serve. He's got five aces, all of them in the first set, but he goes long on that one. It's a service error. 18 service errors now for Tuscal. 14 to 7.
Keenan serve. Landry, Kamshoff, white wide, no tip. That's a point. White wanted a tip. He's looking for the tip. He's begging for a tip. He's not getting a tip. It's like bad service at a restaurant, no tip. 14 to 8. Cheenan will serve. Two deep, Point Pioneers, 15 to 8. Eight service errors now for the Battlers. Loop will serve at 15 to 8. Off the net, played by Schweinfuss. He'll get it back from Brownlee. The net, Grant was there. It's David Schweinefuss across. Loop, Kamshoff, Landry. Miller keeps it alive. Kamshoff across to White. He tips it, gets it down. No, it's still alive. Tipped over by Gray. It's played by Loop. Kamshoff to Grant, blocked over, and it's going to be a point for Tusculum. A lot of action on that point. As Tusculum looked like they had put it down, but Alderson Broad has kept it alive, and then it goes long at 16-8 Tusculum. And loop too strong. It's a point for Alderson Broadus. Gray to serve. Landry right on the line. Kamshoff, Grant, down the line, and wide. It's a point for Alderson Broadus. Off the serve, and it's an ace for Gray. And it's 16 to 10, or 16 11 now. Back to back points. Sixteen eleven. Gray's serve. Miller has it. Kampshoff. Cross. Wide on the attack there was Landry. And Alderson brought us has scored four straight. It's 16-12. Miller for Kampshoff. Grant. Grant again. Still alive. Over the net. On the free ball goes Cheen, and he gets the kill. And it's 16-13, five in a row for the Battlers. Sixteen thirteen. Jalen Gray. Miller for Kampshoff. Grant this time puts it down. Shafar Grant gets the kill. Stops the bleeding, and the Pioneers lead at 17-13. It'll be Shafar Grant to serve. Dustin's got aces from five different players in this match. The only one who has doesn't have an ace, Grant. Cheenan, Brownlee, David Schweinefuss puts it down. His fourth kill, and it's 17-14. Schweinefuss, four kills on eight attacks. Serve is in for Loop. Kampshoff for White. Continues again, Sturm with the kill. Alderson Broad has kept it going off the block, and a timeout for Tusculum, as all of a sudden it's 17-15 Tusculum here in set number four. The Pioneers let it 16 to 8. Or yeah, they led 16 to 8 after a grant kill. And then a service error led to started a five-point run for Alderson Broadus. As they have scored seven of the last eight points to cut it down to a two-point lead at 17 to 15. Both teams have used one timeout in this set. Each have one remaining. Dane Loop, 11 kills, leads the, all players this evening. Jake White with nine, Shafar Grant with eight. 
Sheenan with eight kills for Alderson Broadus. Tuscan with 44 kills this evening. I think it's time to crack open the old record book here. That's a lot of kills, 44. They've had, Tuscan's had a couple five set matches before, so uh, it's, it's likely that they surpassed that before in the match. We'll see where 44 kills ranks in the record book. Tuscan has never lost to Alderson Broadus. They are 4 0 all time against the Battlers. Program has 10 wins in two seasons, and four of them have been against the Battlers. But this is a battle this evening. Miller for Campshaw for White, kept alive by Schweinfuss. Sheenan, still alive. Off of Campshaw, it's a kill for Stern, and it's 17 16. These teams played a four-setter here last year. Alderson brought us in Tusculum, and it was three to one Tusculum. Miller, Kamshoff, White, played by Cheenan. Brownlee, Schweinefuss, blocked by White, Point Pioneers. Big kill, or big block there for White, and it's 18 to 16. The team record for kills in a four-set match is 50 against Lees McRae a couple years ago. Tuscombe now at 44 kills. Eighteen sixteen. White's service. Brownlee's going to have to keep it alive. He does to Schweinefuss. Miller, Kampschoff, Wingo gets it down. Declan Wingo coming through there for the Pioneers with his sixth kill of the match, and Tuscan leads it 19 to 16. The service from White, Cheenan. Greenlee goes by himself, played though by Miller. White, Green with the dig, will play it right on over. Kampshoff sets up Landry. Blocked, still alive. White's going to have to save it. He can't do it. As the block comes through for Brownlee, and it's 19 to 17. Fifth block of the match for the Battlers. Schweinefuss with the serve. Miller, Kamshoff, Landry puts it down. Colby Landry's eighth kill. And Tuscan leads it 20 to 17. And Landry will serve. Tuscan leads it 20 to 17. Landry on the serve. Greenlee. Sturm met by White, but that'll go out. That'll be a kill for Ethan Sturm, his sixth of the match. And we have substitution. Yankeel Cruz Resto, the 6'1 junior out of Orlando, Florida, makes his first appearance of the evening to serve. He does not have an ace yet this season, and he still doesn't. Kampshoff, Loop, with authority. Dane Loop, his 12th kill. And Tuscan leads it 21 to 18, and And there goes Resto back to the bench. Wingo to serve at 21-18. Too strong, 21-19. I know it's obvious to say, but Tuscan doesn't want to go to a fifth set. Brownlee will serve at 21-19. Landry, Kampshoff, Grant, and a bad touch there for Schweinefuss leads to the point for the Pioneers, 22 to 19. Both teams have one timeout remaining in this set. Sean Kampshoff will serve at 22 19. Gets it down, 
And it gets an ace. 23-19 Tusculum. Kamshoff, sixth ace of the match. Timeout asked for by Alderson Broadus. The six aces for Kamshoff is a program single match record. In fact, the five aces that he had in the first set, that alone was a school record. The previous record was four, which was done five previous times, including once by Kamshoff himself. So a big night for Kamshoff. He has 39 assists, which is too shy of the four set record. We don't want to worry about the five set records. The Pioneers trying to close this one out. They need two more points. They lead it 23 to 19. It's the Alderson Broadus squad that is, to, for lack of a better phrase, really battled here this evening. Been a good contest here tonight. Teams met in the conference tournament last year. Gray and Cheenan, the only two that are on the court tonight, who are Nielsen, who played in the first set. So this is a new Balderson Broadus team as the Pioneers get an ace and now lead it 24 19, and now it's match point. as Kampshoff gets his seventh ace. 24-19 Tuscal. Kampshoff on the serve. Brownlee, Green, Sheenan, dug up by Landry. Kampshoff to White, tips it over, dug by Gray. Green for Sheenan, tipped. Landry's got it, plays it over. Gray keeps it alive. Kampshoff, one more for White. It's a free ball. Schweinefuss plays it over. Miller for Kampshoff. Across to Loop for the win. Dane Loop puts it down. Tusculum wins the match. Three to one. And the Pioneers have their first victory for new coach Brian Buckius. Congratulations to Coach Buckius as Tusculum wins it 25 to 19 in the fourth set. Final stat totals on this one. Tusculum finishing the match with 49 kills. Dane Loop leading the way with 13 kills. Jake White and Shafar Grant with nine apiece. Colby Landry with eight. Declan Wingo with six. Sean Kanshop with four. Kampshoff had 40 assists, seven aces, six digs, and three blocks. As Kampshoff really filled the stat sheet tonight for the Pioneers. Taylor West with 10 digs to lead the Pioneers. And Shafar Grant had six blocks for Tusculum. For Alderson Broadness, they were led by Gannon Cheenan, who had eight kills, six for Ethan Sturm. 22 assists for Nathaniel Brownlee, two aces for Jalen Gray, nine digs for Gannon Cheenan, and three blocks for Jalen Gray. Tusculum hit 200 in the match. Alderson brought us negative 0-29, 26 kills, 29 errors. Tusculum 49 kills, 24 errors. Tusculum had 11 aces and 20 errors. Alderson brought us seven aces and eight errors. Alderson brought us out digging Tusculum 40 to 39. Tusculum leading in blocks nine to five. Uh, the Pioneers get the victory, their first win of the season. They're 1-4. They are 1-0 in the Independent Volleyball Association. Alderson Broadus drops to 2-4 overall, 0-1 in the conference. Tuscan back home tomorrow afternoon to take on Erskine. It'll be a 2 o'clock first service, and we'll help you join us on the Pioneer Sports Network. For our producer Aaron Fudge, I'm Jim Miller. Thank you for joining us. Tuscan winning tonight 3-1 to overall.